Hello, here I am doing a quick demonstration of the BlackBerry Z10 linked to a monitor with Bluetooth, keyboard and mouse. Uh, as soon as you turn, as soon as you paired them, everything's good to go. You simply need to turn on and after a few seconds your mouse cursor will appear on the screen and the BlackBerry lights up. So I don't know how clearly you can see that but you've got mouse action there and quite simply, like you do on the playbook, you've got your gestures at the top and the bottom so you can come down put it to sleep mode to the bottom and you can wake up wake up your the phone. As, uh, you've got your normal gestures, you can flick left, flick right and you can peek if you're in an app, as far as I'm aware, all gestures also work. We've got Monday, Tuesday, hourly, and you can also do the peak from here. <laughs> Typical. Now I'll get a message. <clears throat> but it also works in games as far as I can tell. I'm we'll going to here, load up the logo game. Just wait for that second. Right, whilst waiting for that to load up, I'll show you the keyboard. Go into uh, just open up docs to go. Just create a new document. That's good. Just, 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 stop working. just do this quickly. It's so much easier. Rotation lock isn't on. So why are you not going that way? Ah. If you want the rotation to start automatically, it helps you start the phone landscape. So you boot that up. There you go. There you go, learning with you. It's just the keyboard, nice simple £20 from my local PC world. Did I turn it on or I didn't turn it on. Helps. So yes, here I am with the keyboard, all turned on now. And as you can see, caps lock works, you can go right. shift works, shift like that. Tap enter, you drop your line, and you can scroll through your keys. You can also select, hold shift, you know, like on a PC. There you go, you've got your select, drop a line, you can select more. Nice and simple. Press to link. I don't know if copy and paste works, so I'll just quickly test that. FN, no. don't press FN. Copy and paste doesn't work with this keyboard, others it might though. One thing I have noticed with your Bluetooth keyboard is that it takes away your autocorrect features. Uh, for example, if I spell something wrong. It no longer autocorrects it for me. Unfortunately, as it stands, there is no way of correcting it as far as I can tell. 
Ah, there you go. Yes, there is. You can click that down there. No, oh, now you want to do it. So yeah, still a bit long-winded. It'd be nice to have a right click, like you're on a PC. So you click that, click here, and tip. And I've ignored the spelling mistake, but it will come up telling you how to do it. Try it again, just to show you. There you go, that's wrong. Nib. There you go. Now he corrects it. That was a bit long-winded. Right, we'll just jump back into the logo again. Okay, click play again. Everything works. Go into something. Choose it. Just for example, so that goes away where the keyboard is supposed to. That all works. Tap enter. And as you see, all works. We'll just try and. Here we are just testing a different type of game. Uh, Lego, nope, Star Wars Angry Birds. Just turn this down a bit. Let's see if this works. No. Let's just see if it's got partial functionality. No, so not all games work. Here's another app demonstration just to show you that most of the apps work. Uh, if we go into Crackberry's own Spark Me, open a picture. Open up a picture, we'll use that picture. And as you can see, just scrolling around perfectly. You can is it gone? Scrolls perfectly. And then you just should cut it. That has sparked this one. As you can see, safe picture. That works perfectly. One thing I really do like is the vertical and horizontal flip between on the monitor between your de or the face of your desktop to your hub. So if you're in it or in an app, you go like that. Peak, oh, I've got a message. There you go. Automatically flips horizontally for me. Got your reply to that. Secret so peak, everything works with the mouse. You can, if you're on a website, so yes, even when, when you're web browsing, again, it flips horizontally. You've got your middle scroll wheel, you can browse through your web page, or you can not click and drag anymore. It's all to do your scroll wheel. One thing I did forget to mention is whilst in a web browser you can use your scroll wheel in many apps you can't you can crack present for a map so you'd have to again click and drag like you do with your finger so that concludes my quick demonstration of mobile computing from Blackberry offers more functionality in the playbook but I hope with a few more updates it comes a long way you still can't copy and paste you can't highlight correctly with the as you do on a mouse and you can't work in all games but most apps apps themselves work it's just games 